Good morning, good evening, good night. My name is Sergey, and I coincidentally play the drums. Right over there. 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 And today, of all days, I am gonna be doing something not drum related. Weird, right? But it's not a big issue. Today, I'm gonna be reviewing the Music Man Bongo 6 JMHH. I don't know if that's the right order, but let's fucking do this. So, the Music Man Bongo, John My Young, which is right here, starts at $3,000, 3090 $3,100 and it is a six string bass with a five string neck so that the strings are a little bit narrower and it's so that you can move around faster because if you don't know who John My Young is, John My Young is the bass player of the ultimate band Dream Theater and they play a lot of very fast, very quick things and it's a lot to handle sometimes. The John My Young signature bass from Music Man is a basswood body, so it's pretty light, and the neck is a two-tone neck, so it has rosewood and maple. The reason for this is because the six strings on the six string bass need to be EQ'd differently for different parts of the music. So the maple part of the fretboard is gonna have a higher, brighter tone and it's gonna be pronounced more in the mix. Unless you're John My Young, then you're not in the mix. Holy shit, I'm just kidding. The rosewood part of the neck is so that the bass strings are warmer and more under the mix and more, but still pronounced, but not too pronounced, you know what I mean? I personally like the six string bass because of its form factor. I like the, the narrow neck because a six string neck normally is basically a skateboard and that is too much. That is too much finger space, but some people like that and I don't judge because I don't judge things. The reason why I like that they're so narrow is because I like to play a lot of fast things like Dream Theater, but when I'm filling in for someone on bass, I like to have the ability to hit the sixth string while also hitting the bass string, the, the, the B string at the bottom. So I can hit both of those at the same time because of the smaller form factor neck. Another feature of the Music Man Bongo 6 John My Young HH is that it doesn't have a tone knob. Now this might seem pretentious coming from Music Man because Music Man's tone is legendary. So any funk music you hear, anything that Joe Dart plays, that's a Music Man basically. And it sounds so fucking good. It sounds incredible. The Music Man bass that I'm showing you guys has only volume and pickup selector. That's it, nothing more, nothing less. Music Man just said, trust us, our sound is great. Not that they would say that, but they, they are saying that with this. When you get the Music Man Bongo 6 in the mail, it comes in a nice cardboard box, taped up pretty damn nicely, and it comes in its own Music Man sanctioned mono bass case. So it's molded on the inside for protection of the bass, and it's a TSA case so that you can bring it around on flights, you could bring it around the world, you could bring it to your mom's house, to your grandmother's house, to your aunt's house, your sister's house, anything. You can just bring it because it has such a slimmed down case because normally a music man would come with one of the hard shell cases that have like the logo on it that say Bongo 6 or something like that. I know the Majesty comes with an artist series uh, like plaque on the case that says Majesty and then John Petrucci's signature and that's a hard case. So I do like that it comes in kind of like a soft case because not everybody wants to lug around a hard case because obviously it's not fun to do. At the same time, some people prefer it over the uh, the soft mono case. 
Right now I'm going to give you guys some samples of what the bass sounds like in different types of tones and different types of styles of music. That's why I also like this bass because it's very versatile so it can do a lot of different styles of music. It can go from jazz, it can go for progressive metal, thank you. It can go for rock, it can go for funk. Whatever you want it to do, it can do. And that's why it's one of the best bases in the world. <laughs> 